All right. Last one on the board. And this will this will get us out of here. 10.30 p.m. Eastern Time. USC heading to Arizona State. And the Sun Devils are an eight and a half point favorite. Total is 60. This Drake London injury has got to hurt the Trojans because their offense was majorly predicated on what he was able to do in that receiving core. Somehow, Arizona State is number 11 in EPA per play margin. <laughs> USC is number 90 in that metric. The question here, like there's a bunch of questions. Does Jackson Dart provide a spark for this Trojan offense? Which team has quit? Because it kind of looked like both of them did last week. Does Arizona State clean up the mistakes? Because, man, they had a gargantuan amount of them, just a sack full of problems last week against Washington State when they were 16-point favorites. I... I'm going to take Arizona State here because I do think they are the better team, and I think they still have something to play for. USC is just trying to figure out what's going on until they until they get a new coach. I just I, this is a ugly matchup, but it could end up being a lot of fun for being a Pac-12 after dark game. What uh, what you got on it? Yeah, no, I'm with you. I just uh, I can't bet one nickel on this USC team. It's a, I almost can't bet one nickel on uh, on Arizona State, and yet I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna take them here. Yeah, that, I, they don't they don't bother me. I don't think they quit. I mean, they they still have a coach that's competent, and capable, and knows what he's doing. Like I'm not worried about that. Yeah, yeah, I can I can get down with that. Thanks for listening to the Winning Cures Everything podcast. The website is winningcureseverything.com, and if you want to connect with us, we're on Twitter at GaryWCE at Chris B. Giannini, at Winning Cures, or you can email us, Gary at winningcureseverything.com or Chris at winningcureseverything.com. Subscribe everywhere you need to subscribe, and we'll see you soon.